It's your girl No Way Jose here with Mixtape Madness and we're outside Cressy Arthur's headline show. He's sold out the thing, yeah? Sold it out, yeah? People are spending their hard earned money, their hard earned cash to come out here. I've got fine babes behind me, look at them. They're all ready to bag a husband, yeah? So we're here to have good time, good vibes. So come in with me and let's check it out. Me. Okay, we are joined here by the man of the hour, the superstar, Kwesi Alpha. Oh, what's up? Hey, what's up? What's up? Okay, so how, how are you feeling? Are you ready for today? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of excited. Um, though nervous, but I'm ready, Charlie. We could go. Oh, you're ready. I see you're dripping, though. Oh, I see you dripping no, from head to toe. Talk me through this. What's this? Hold oh, no, on, this one there. Like, I'll change. I'll change later. Oh, okay. So, oh, so you're going to give us something else. Yeah. So this yeah. is just a pre... But you're still swaggy, though. Oh, no, no. This one there. <laughs> no, nah, this... Light drip. This is a light drip. And then you're going to bring on some more drip. Yeah. Okay. Drip too hard. I hear you. I hear you. Okay, so I just wanted to ask you. So obviously your fans want to know... People are here to see you. People have yeah. come, people have bought the tickets to come and see you. How do you feel that like, these people come to you, especially in the UK? I'm just grateful. Like, from Ghana, here in London, Charlie, people buying tickets just to see Kwesi Arthur. Like, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's great. Like, I feel the love. So, shout out to everyone who bought tickets, Charlie. Bless her. Yes. So, how long have you been rapping for? Um, I've been since 2010 in senior high school. But it wasn't that serious till like 2015 when I met some people like Ground Up Charlie. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So do you feel like they pretty much helped you like take off your career? Yeah, yeah. Like they helped it. develop my talent and like help me get out there. Okay. Yeah, did so. they did they help you with the source or did you always have the source? Oh yeah, they helped. Like they helped me develop. Yeah, my talent. As an like artist. yeah, they helped me. Um, they helped like. Teach me how to write and stuff, you bab. Like, gave me the guidance and stuff. Yeah. So, do in all of this, that like saying obviously you've been doing it since you was in school. Yeah. Did you ever think that you'd be this successful? Um. Okay. The thing is, like, with every, in everything I do, like, I want to be successful. Like, I picture myself being like the guy at the top, like you bab, with everything. You'll be that but guy. I didn't. I didn't know I'll be here like this quick. You get me? Because I know people who started this, like, been in this for 10 years, 20 years, and, like, still, like, it's not really popping off. So I'm just grateful to be here. I feel like, like there's a there's a divine being, like, in this. Yeah. But, yeah. So I'm just grateful to be here. Good. And then, obviously, like, you've obviously been probably inspired by loads of people. Yeah. And a little birdie told me that Drake also yeah. inspired you yeah. along the yeah. way. So just tell me about that and how did Drake inspire you to be? Um, so in 2010... A friend of mine introduced me to Thank Me Later. Like, that was a Drake tape. Um, I started listening to it, and I thought, oh, Charlie. Like, he made it rap sound so easy. Yeah. But Because he was just talking about him, like, just stuff he's going through. Yeah. To get to. yeah what so was your thought, favorite album? What was your favorite song on the album? Um, like, I like a couple of songs. Show me a good, show me a good, good time. time. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Then I'll be up all night. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like a couple of songs. Like, there are a couple of songs in there that I, that I'm into a lot. Yeah, but so listening to that tape made me realize I could, I could make music too. So I started writing and stuff. Yeah, and it's been just, it's been good. It's been taken so off ever so since. Yeah. yeah. So obviously in the Afrobeat scene, you've obviously collabed with a lot of artists, like Kode, yeah. obviously R2Bs, yeah. many, many people. Who has been your best collab and why? Who's been my best collab? Collab, like, in what sense? Like, all the like, other people that you've collabed with, yeah. who have you, like, liked working with the most? Um, Like, it's it's always a pleasure to work with all these artists. But I feel like... Who? Who's here? Who? Like, it's been, it's been good working with all of them. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I just can't single out, and like, one person. But it's been good working with Stoneboy, Shatawali, um, Sarkodie, Manifest, um... Who Wale Kwame, Sheezy, Caesar Millet, um, DJ Copy, like 
She's a Millie be my guy. Well. But yeah, it's been good. It's been good working it's with been all good. these people. So obviously, with all your hard work, you also got recognised as well. So obviously, you were nominated for BT's yeah. Best International. Yeah. How did you feel about that? And what was it like for you? Um, like that came as a surprise, to be honest. That came as a surprise. I was just on my regular like duties with my guys, and I saw it on Twitter. But like, no one told me about it. I found out on Twitter, so yeah. I was shocked. I didn't believe it when I first saw it, but then I went. I went on BT International's website and I yeah. found out, oh, Charlie's... Oh, so you favorite. just found out on the website? Yeah, I just found out on Twitter. When everybody else found yeah, out, basically. Yeah, so I was just I was just shocked, super shocked. So what was going through your mind when you looked at it? Like, what were you doing? I was like, like, hey, what were you doing? I, I, I was in the car. Yeah, I was in the car. I think my guys were getting a video or something from yeah, someone. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and I saw it. And Ch- I didn't believe it. I didn't believe it. You thought yeah. it was a hoax? You thought it was like, yeah, yeah. Like, you know... One a meme. Those, yeah, yeah, but Charlie... I went there. Every, everything was good. Yeah. Okay, so I heard as well that before rapping as well, if you weren't doing rapping, that you yeah. wanted to be, is it a journalist? Yeah, yeah. So you wanted to, like, read the news? Yeah, true. So, like, what, does that mean, like, okay, so everything that you did in school, was that yeah. English your best subject? Yeah, one of them. One of the best. But subjects. the thing was, you know, growing up in Ghana, every kid wants to play football. Yeah. But, so I, when, I, when I started, like, I wanted to be a footballer. And at one point, it just changed because they kept scoring our team so many times. Like, we always lost. So it just changed. And at one point, I wanted to be a lawyer. At one point, I wanted to be a pilot. So you want to do everything. A soldier, <laughs> yeah. And I just ended up being an artist. Okay. Yeah. So, okay, since you wanted to be a journalist, I'm going to test you a little bit. Yeah. So out of like now, so just obviously current stuff that's happening. Yeah. Who did Ghana beat in the African Cup of Nations recently? Oh, that, so this is the easy. test. Guinea Ghana's Bissau, watching. Guinea Bissau, I was watching the game. Guinea Bissau. Okay, that's yeah. it. You got it. You got like, it. You got it. them two 0 Charlie. Okay, so obviously, like in terms of like your, we spoke about school when that like English being one of your favorite subjects and stuff like that. What was your worst subject? That English wasn't my favorite subject. Was it not? No, my favorite subject was history. History. Yeah. That yeah. makes sense, and obviously because you write music as well, yeah, yeah. So that makes sense. That story. Yeah. So what was your worst yeah. subject then? My worst subject. My worst subject. Ah, I don't think. Any was it any language? Okay, I think or? it was. It was chemistry. Chemistry. Yeah, That's quite cause... hard, though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Because like I didn't understand what was going on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And like the teacher was like very strict. So, so usually I wasn't even in class when he came. So you was missing school. Oh, no, <laughs> I was missing some classes. Some classes, yeah, the ones that were yeah, boring. Yeah. But Charlie stay in school. Everyone stay in school, yeah, stay in school. Yeah, stay we're in not going to that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so obviously, how many times have you been to the UK? Uh, this is my fourth time. Your fourth time? Yeah. Okay, so obviously, I've been looking as well, and you've been quite influenced. You've, you've got quite a good connection with the UK, as yeah. it stands. Obviously, you've had features with people like Sneakbo. Yeah. You've also done um, your fire in the booth with Charlie Sloth, which is yeah. like a big thing as well. Yeah. And I see you in Ghana taking pictures with Heady One. Yeah. You know, so you're basically an honorary UK citizen. We're taking you. We'll take you. I know. We'll get, you. I know. Get passport. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll, we'll get. We'll get you one. We'll take okay, one cool, to you. Cool. Okay. So because obviously you've been in the UK for quite a while, and obviously you're quite connected to the UK, I'm going to test you on some UK slang. Okay. Yeah. So I've got a few questions, and I've got a few slang words, and you've just got to guess. What, what they are, okay. yeah, what they mean. Okay, so the first one is clapped. Clapped. Do you want me to put it in a sentence? Like maybe someone getting beaten down or something. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'll put it. I'll put it in a sentence. Okay. So, okay, you look so clapped, or that girl is clapped. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ugly. Oh. Yes. Oh my God. You can't cheat. You can't cheat. You can't cheat. Okay, another one. Another one. Okay, so that girl is peng. Oh yeah, she's nice. She's nice, she's yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. And of one more, it's a mad thing. It's a mad thing, like it's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, okay, yeah. just before you like get on to get on stage, what is it that you do to like get yourself ready to stage? Like I just think like just just sit down and just like process my thoughts. Like yeah. And you get in your zone. Yeah. Okay, and that's been with that being said, we'll just leave you in your zone, get cool, yourself cool, ready, cool. Thank you and so much. we'll check you out later. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you for having me, Shelly. This is exciting. Uh, okay, you're back with your girl, No Way Jose, and I'm here with the other superstar of the night, 
Mr. Silkstone. Hey. He's even doing Instagram posts already. He's doing How? lean back against the wall. He's but ready. Okay. And he's got the, he's got the shades of Versace. Why not? Let me a fiver. Let me a fiver. He's got Versace shades on, yeah? <laughs> so anyway, how are you feeling about tonight? I'm blessed, you know what I mean? I'm out here to support my brother. for you see Arthur, you know what I mean? We've got a rec couple records together. So. I know. Yeah. So, so you guys have got like a long standing history. Like, how did that come about? Um, through management really and then we connected um, when he came over to the UK last year we worked on some records and then I went to Ghana shot like a bunch of videos we did two videos out there so it was really cool and okay, I mean, yeah okay. Susanna remix and we've got another one one by one that's gonna drop also yes so obviously you got a lot of heat coming you got, you're coming for people's necks you're coming hey, for everyone's necks I'm not yeah? coming for any neck <laughs> I'm coming to enjoy life. I'm coming to do enjoyment. Enjoyment. <laughs> okay, so when you go on stage, like, yeah. what do you do to prepare yourself? Like, just just stay calm and conserve my energy. Just that's like, it. Mm, yeah, that's all it. All of that. Man. That's, it. that's it. Just just relax. Don't need no alcohol. Don't need no alcohol. It's just good vibes. Just good vibes. See what's in it. Hey. Baby, I'm serious. She made me delirious. I wanna to ask her. Today, like, is it like the energy that you get from the crowd? Is it just like performing content? What is it for you? I would say just performing content. Obviously, the energy from the crowd. You know, it's really good to be able to like, you know, put your music out and you know, let people enjoy it. Let people do what you know they love when they hear good music, which okay. is really good. enjoyment. Yeah. Okay. So just That's it, goes man. Your follow your passion. You follow what you want to do. Follow your dream. Let me put down a vision and follow it. So that's what I did. And the main thing is enjoy the journey. That's it. That's it. Oh, that's so cool, so cool. Hey, so cool, so cool. <laughs> it's your girl, No Way Jose here with Mixtape Madness, and I'm joined with none other than Energy, energy, yeah, no, energy, you know what I mean? Clap for yourself. <laughs> so, Rams, I've got a bone to pick with you. Why mm. did you do Barking and not Enfield or anywhere in North London? Because I'm from, why don't you do that? Story. I'll do that next. Do that next. Mm, North London. Where about? Enfield. <laughs> Ibiza, yeah. you were telling me. So how was Ibiza for you? Like, like, do you know, I don't really remember the first day. Because you were just the second day, on the wave. second day it was calm, but the first day I don't remember anything. Don't remember anything. Remember so nothing. the girls in Barking or the girls in Ibiza? Mm. The girls in Ibiza were very nice. Because they are walking around half naked. Nice. Half naked. naked. Half naked. Naked. Nice. <laughs> No, I was feeling it still, I can't even lie to you. So at the moment, the girls want to know, yeah. are you single, taken, what, what's the situation? Single, still, so. single, so the girls can slide in the DMs. Yeah, All the girls can slide in the DMs, it's ready for you, you lot. Slide in the DMs, it's ready for you, yeah? So they can slide in, yeah? yeah. You sure? What kind of girls do you normally go for? So they know, so they Let's know. Oh, they want to know though. Personally. <laughs> That's easy to come out. Alright, personally, personally, personally. <laughs> Everyone's like, bombs up, bombs up. Personally, that's what you gotta say. Anyway, so how was your performance? How did you feel like being on stage? Oh, crazy. I feel Sick. like I, I need to go to Ghana. It's your girl, no way, Jose here, back with mixtape madness, and I've got none other than Sneak Ball. I'm on your done no, I'm He's here to, <laughs> to show us the wave. Sneak Ball, you just come off. You're ready sweating. You're ready here. Like you're ready. ready. How was it on stage? No, man, it was lit. Big up crazy Alpha. Get me coming from Ghana to shut down London. Cheers. I'm and not even Ghanaian, I'm Nigerian, but get me Ghana, my brothers. That's fair. Black stars, black. What's your Ghanaian name? What is your Ghanaian name if you're going to be Ghanaian? Me... I like loads. I like Kwabana. I like, I like loads of names. Just call me anything. Kwabana! Call me whatever you want. 
What are you saying his name is? What's his, what's his name? Got it him. Kwaku. 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 You're saying the English way. Kwaku. Oh, Kwaku. But it's actually Kwaku. Alright, cool. Call me whatever you want when I'm in Ghana. What should mine be? Hot spice. Okay then, you heard it here first. Hot spice. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay. So Sneak Boy, anyway, Sneak Boy's already performed. He's done his thing. Shut it down. Shelling, shelling, shelling. When you go on stage, what is it that you do to prepare to get on stage? I just, I'm just, I don't you do know. know. I don't know. No, 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 no. I'm just ready. I'm always ready. Always before, ready. Still before ready. I used to like overthink, but now I'm just, I'm ready. As soon as you I hear that song, go. bam, I'm out there. It's lit. I know it's lit all the time. Now. Cheers! <laughs> no and question. always, I want to say congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> you know, if you know, if you know, you know. Thank you. We know. Don't know. Okay, so how do you feel now? As um, how do you feel as a father? How do you feel like you've got you've got into a different realm of life? How do you feel yeah. now? I feel I feel good. I feel grown. I feel like I need to set an example and be a good dad and show the kids how it's meant to be. Get me? Because I didn't grow up with my dad, but yeah, you want to be a good dad. Cheese! Take care of my child. Obviously. Make sure you take yep. care of yours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn no. Obviously, we're here. Hey, I'm gonna be the stepdad, so look after yourself. Hey, <laughs> we're here for black representative, black positive male representatives. Positive, That's what we're here for. Positive. Okay, so one more question for you, Sneak Bow. Yeah. Okay, so now obviously you've been out and about, you've been in the scene for a time. Yeah. Since I was in school going to underage raves, Mad. you've been there. Mad. Do you know what I mean? So, what is it that you're doing now? So, what can people look forward to? Right, Have you got right anything now, cooking got, up in there? I got a single out now. Just an audio featuring my logo called Premi. And then I got a, the video coming out this Sunday. This interview might be out by then, or I don't know. But yeah, this Sunday, video Premi. So make sure you look out for that album, August, hopefully, and tour real soon. Yes! And hopefully, I get a date. No, I'm joking. Ah. Wave, jet ski, done no. What's your name? <laughs> Jose. Jose. Where no you from? way, Jose. Where you from? What do you mean, country, area? Both. Okay, Uganda. Yeah. North London. North London? Yeah. <laughs> Never done it. I thought you were from heaven. <laughs> oh, uh, North London. Okay. Is it from heaven? From heaven. <laughs> <laughs>